Welcome back everyone, thank you for joining me in today's video. Let's get straight into it by turning some of this into one of these. So first step of today's video, I will be collecting uncontaminated aluminium swarf from the lathe chip tray. The swarf here is from an exciting project I have coming up. So now I have the aluminium swarf, I'm going to use it to make the conrod and piston. Next step will be melting down and recasting the aluminium swarf into some usable stock using a homemade furnace and crucible. Here I'm using a blowtorch to gently warm the moulds to take the chill off so it doesn't set the aluminium prematurely. That's the swarf melted down and cast into something usable. I will be using this piece for the piston and this piece for the comrade. The next step will be to head over to the vise and cut off the excess material. Now I've finished cutting the excess material off with a hacksaw. The next step is to square it off in the milling machine and reface all the sides. Now with all the sides refaced, the next step will be to drill the two holes in what will be the comrade. With the holes complete, the next step is to start shaping the comrade. We'll swap it over and do the other side. That's the conrod roughly cut out. All that's left to do is to polish the machine marks out. That's the comrod complete. I'm very happy with how it came out. I'm over by the lathe now. I'm going to machine the second piece of rough casting down and make the piston. I've turned the outside diameter down to the correct size. The next step is to bore the inside out for the comrade. I'm going to do this in three stages, starting with a centre drill. I 
I finished boring up the hole for the comrade. The next step is to put the grooves in. Piston is nearly complete. I'm just about to part it off from the casting. Last step on the lathe is just a reface to clean up from the parting off. The final step is to drill the hole for the conrod pin before final assembly. Now for the final assemble. So there you have it. Turn an aluminium swarf into a piston keyring. I hope you enjoyed it. Please like and subscribe. See you next time.